What's up, Future Fighters? It's Alex here from Buddy Fight News Corner, bringing you a double box opening of um, Four Dimensions. Because I got the double, the two boxes, I got the promo pack. It comes with two foil flags and two reprints with alternate arts. So here we have a really shiny Divine Guardian swag. It might be too bright for the camera. No. You, you may use cards of guardians and generic cards, and your hand becomes six, your gauge becomes one, your life becomes twelve. Executioners. You may use cards with executioners and generic cards. Your initial hand becomes six, your initial gauge becomes four, and your initial life becomes eight. Got symbol guard. You may cast this and you have six or less life. If there's a Breath and Guard, you could cast it for free. Pay one gauge, draw two cards. And then Earth Barrier. You may cast this if you're being attacked. Nullify the attack and you gain one life. Alright, so let's get into the box. If I can get past the plastic. Come on. It's probably the hardest part of the box. Divine Guardian swag, but it's not shiny, so we won't be using it. Max rarity, or die. Low rarity is a sin, except when you're poor, like me. Alright, let's get started. Executioner Hammer Hellsponder. If you have 15 cards and drop, it gets crit plus 2. Wow, 4 crit. Divine Guidance. You may cast this if you are being attacked. Oh, an attack on your opponent's turn, and you have a monster with Zodiac. Nullify the attack. Gain life and top deck a gauge. Move. 2 1 2. Size 0. Huh. Size 0 move. Sparkling Envoy Kirare. And pay one gauge. Search your deck for a gate of given and add it to your hand. If you have two cards, a listen drop, it gets power plus three. So it comes to six, two, one. Oh, that's pretty good. Eternal Envoy Eater. Why are you a double rare? When you attack, return it from the field to the hand. Move. You should not be a double rare. That is such a waste of a double rare spot. Shadow Crusader. Top three cards in your deck into your drop zone. Counter for this turn. The next time you take damage, reduce it by three. Seven, three, six. Pay two gauge. If this card's in your center, all your size two or less stars becomes zero. If they're on your left or right. Well, that's pretty cool. Size zero, it's soul guard. Dragon arms jamming. Ah, my first zodiac dragon arms. This card enters the field, a monster with Zodiac in it gets crit plus one. So you do nothing in the soul. How could you call yourself a Dragon Arms? Then Swoop Envoy Angelus, Blessing Pierce. When this card enters the field, if you have a Gator Forgiven or one card or less in drop, draw a card. Eighth Omni Dual Dragon, Zabinel. When it enters the field, if you have an item equipped or another dual dragon, put the top card of your deck into the gauge. 201, size 0. Not bad. Size 1 Black Dragon? No. Deep Death, Deep Executioner. You have 6 or more cards and drop, it gets power plus 3. 221 with move. Hanako! Pay 1 gauge, all monsters on your field get plus 1, plus 1. And then. I Soma, Envoy Soma. When this card enters the field, put two cards from your drop zone into the bottom of your deck. If you have three or more or less cards in your drop, put the top card of your deck into your gauge, or you gain one life. Not bad, but not necessarily good. Hell Shield. You may pay you cast this card on an attack on your opponent's turn. If you have an executioner on your field, pay one gauge. Nullify the attack. If you have ten or more in drop, top deck two gauge. And this cannot be nullified. Then if you have 15 or more, deal damage. So 
both like red dragon and the blue dragon shield in one. Frozen stars. We, if you guys don't know what it does already, hey two gauge. There's star on your left and right. Nullify all cards on your opponent's field and the soul of your opponent's cards. This cannot be nullified. All is on the field, and you may only have one set. Card Rhino. He did not e need easier access to card burn, because card burn is cancer. Deity of Law. You may cast this when you are being attacked. Move a Neo Dragon or Guardian to the center and change it that the attack target to that monster. Foil Black Beast Battle Arts. Put the top four cards of your deck into your drop zone, choose an executioner, and it gets plus two, plus two, and counterattack. Then if you have 15 or more, it gets plus two, plus two. Huh. So plus four, plus four, and counterattack is pretty good. And Silhouette Spirit. Mutation Shadowfy. When the center is the field, you may put a spell from your drop into the soul of a monster on your field. The named effect may only activate once per turn. Little Lights. Put, the, put up to one monster from your deck into your gauge or drop zone, and then gain one life. Wow, that's pretty good. Lua Nova. Discard a card from your hand. If the discarded card was... Whoa. Come on, focus. Focus. If the card discarded from your hand by the cast cost is Legend World, gain one life, draw one card. If it's Star Dragon World, put the top card of your deck into your gauge and destroy a size two or less on your opponent's field. Why is Star Dragon World all about destruction? And the Legend's all about advantage. When this card is destroyed, you may pay one life. If you do, return this card to your hand. 3 one, one. Go away, card engine. Go away. And Gate of Pardon Forgiven. You may only have one set. Act, put three cards from the drop zone to the bottom of your deck. If you put three cards, you may gain a life. If you do not have a monster on your field and there are no cards in your drop zone, put a card from your hand that's at the bottom of your deck. If you do, call one guardian from your deck by paying its skull cost. Then shuffle the deck. Oh, I'm so hyped to play guardians. I really hope I could play it after all of my boxes are opened. Put the top three cards of your deck into the drop zone. If you do, destroy an item or spell on your opponent's field. Medusa shield. You may only cast this during an attack on your opponent's turn. Pay one gauge to nullify the attack. If you have two or more stars on your field, this cannot be nullified. Pay one gauge, one life. Counter, destroy a monster on your opponent's field with 5,000 or less defense. That actually hits a lot. Wow. Nativity Envoy Bloom Dragon Jr. When it's good, if you have three car or less cards in your drop zone, gain one life. Oh, and then a Buddy Rare. Guardian Deity of Paradise Avalon. If you have five or less cards in your drop zone, this gets crit plus one. If you have no cards in your drop, it gets crit plus one. When this card enters the field, put up to three cards from your drop zone on the bottom of your deck in any order. If you put three cards, gain one life. And it's got double attack. 818. Eight. Not bad. I like it. The art's really nice, too. Own style, Sliding Fang, choose an Executioner, the next time it would be destroyed, nullified its destruction. When it enters the field, pay one gauge. If you do, search for Gate of Verdict Judgment. 3, 2, 1. Pay one gauge. When it enters the field, put the top two, three cards of your deck into your drop zone, then put one Dragon Arm or Guardian from among them into your hand. If there's a monster with soul on your field, and or there are no cards in your drop, it gets crit plus one. Oh, that's actually really good. In Guardians, not in really, not really in Star Dragon World. Then a foil of the size zero Soul Guard. Probably never gonna use you, but foils are always nice. Meteor Arms, Pisca Pisca. <laughs> when you put this card from the field or drop into the soul of size zero, put the top or size three, put the top card of the deck into your gauge. Three one one. So it's a tall nada for size threes. If there's five or more cards in your drop zone, it gets crit plus one. Four, two, one. 
act during an attack on your opponent's turn. Put the top three cards of your deck into your drop zone. Pay one gauge. Nullify the attack. Oh, wow. Three, two, six. Executioner Skull Warrior. That's nice. Go away, card burn. Null, pal null place. Infernal rule. You may cast this if you have an executioner on your field. A1 gauge. Destroy a size 2 or less monster on your opponent's field. If you have 20 or more cards in your drop, destroy a card on your opponent's field instead. So, if you have 20 or more, destroy anything. That's nice. Wasn't the original translation destroy two things? Oh. Guess that it got nerfed. Black Beast Battle Arts. Eisen Tiger. Moon Dragon Jr. Woo! Foil of the Skull Warrior. Thornet Fishing. When this card enters the field, put the top two cards of your deck into your drop zone. If there's an executioner among those, draw a card. So if you're playing executioners, draw a card. Got it. Cool. Great Ocean High King Duel Jaeger. Pay two gauge. Put up one card from your drop zone into this card's soul. When this card enters the field, discard a card from your hand. If you do, put a Dragon Chief Emperor from your drop zone into your hand. Oh, that's really good. That's really good for Dragon Chiefs. Oh, the Jaeger build in specific. Scorpia. Sentinel Stars. If you have a star on your field, you can cast it, put the top two cards of your deck into your gauge, then you may discard a card to gain two life. Blitz Envoy Shiny Bell. Put this card from the field and a card from your drop zone on the bottom of your deck in any order. If you do, put the top card of your deck into your gauge. Huh. Now it's way different from the original translation. Speculate Ring. Hey! Elixir. Pay one gauge and put the top card of your deck into this card's soul. All cards on your field get plus two power, then if you have two or less cards in your drop, all cards on your field get plus one crit. Move and soul guard. You are the sole reason why I wanted to play Guardians. Well, not the sole reason, but one of the reasons. Treasure Jailer Sonder Dock. When this card enters the field, put the top three cards of your deck into your drop zone and take one damage. Act. Landslide. This card's in your drop zone and pay one gauge. If you do call this card from your drop zone, you may only use Landside once per turn. Tsukikage Canis Mode. 2 on 1. 2 on 1 Puppy Tsukikage. Size 0. This card's in the soul of a size 3 Neo Dragon. That card gets move. Yay! Trust on Voice Soul Feed. At the end of the battle, this card attacked. If you have an item equipped, you may put this card into your gauge. Well, that's really good. Knight? Guardian? Oh, why aren't you an adventurer? Heaven's Shield. You may only cast this during an attack on your opponent's turn. If you uh, do not have a monster in the center, you have a guardian on your field. Nullify the attack and gain a life. Then if you have no cards in your drop zone, it can't be nullified. Maybe I shouldn't have gone over all these cards. That's about to be a long box opening. Probably not. The net. The, the next one won't be so bad. Pay one gauge, nullify the lifelink of all monsters on your field, and return all monsters from the field to hand. Put the top two cards of your deck into your drop zone, pay one gauge. Put this into the soul of another monster. If it's in the soul of a ninja or executioner, that monster gets soul guard. Then if there's 15 or more in your drop, that monster gets crit plus one. That's amazing in Gojinmaru, holy crap. Schrodinger, we should have gotten this a long time ago. Hell's Shield. And if you're playing Executioner, draw a card. Oh, a foil Hell Shield. I was wondering why I got two rares. Barret. When your monster attack when your opponent's monster attacks, you may put the top card of your deck into the drop zone. If you do that card as a monster or item deal one damage. To your opponent. If that card is a spell, you take one damage. If that card is an impact, deal three to your opponent. God forbid you mill an impact monster. Then your opponent cries. Pay one gauge, double attack, black dragon. Because, you know, black dragons totally needed a double attacker. If you have no cards in your drop zone, this, power, this card gets power plus four. 
Myth. In fact, you may cast this card if your opponent has three or less life and your opponent does not have a monster in the center. And there are no cards in your drop zone. Pay two life, deal three. And the other gate. Put the top two cards of your deck into your drop zone. If there is an executioner among them, put the top card of your deck into your gauge. Act, pay three. If you put an executioner from your drop zone into your hand, then if you have 15 or more executioners in your drop zone, draw a card. So good. See it. Pure envoy, pure white envoy Wittia. Pay one gauge. If you have five or less in your drop, this card gets penetrate. And this card attacks. If you have gate of forgiven on your field, or if you have three or less cards in your drop, this card gets double attack. X generation 5th Omni Cavalry Dragon Sand Staff Ben S. Nash. You have a size 3 Dragon World Monster on your field. The size of this card is reduced by 1. Then once card enters the field, put the top card of your deck into the soul of monster if you do take a damage. And then a Never Say Never. That was good because uh, I, I needed that for shades too. I need more Never Say Nevers. Lethal Poison Jailer Scylla Leroy. During an attack on your opponent's turn, if you have four or more spells in your drop, call this card from your hand and change the target to this card instead. Huh. That's really good. Not really in shades, but you know. It's pretty good. For Vanilla, 21. Dungeon El Quixote. Uniform Sister Frill. Pay one gauge. If you're transformed into a card, give that card plus one power and crit plus one. Oh my gosh, and Captain Answer. Woo! Boy, the fire. Damien's Decision. Put the top two cards of your deck into your drop zone. If there's an Executioner among them, put the top card of your deck into your gauge and draw a card. Wish I could play that music. Shades, that'd be amazing. Second half of the box. This, this will probably go a lot faster now that I've gone through most of the commons. Lenovo. Solid Leroy, Encouragement of the White Veil. During this turn, your item gets crit plus one and penetrate. Choose a guardian and give it plus three, plus three and counterattack. Put a card from your drop zone to the bottom of your deck at the cost. There's not even a cost. This card enters the field, pay one gauge, search for Gate of Forgiven, add it to your hand, shuffle the deck. Demon Way, Akishigiri. Pay one gauge, put the top two cards of your deck into your drop zone and draw a card. And you've got 15 or more, 10 or more and drop, draw a card. Sorry, didn't focus. Where are my triple rares? Double attack, 424, for one gauge. Size 2. Metamorph. Soma. Espada Runar. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Ah! The Guardian Impact Monster. Pay three gauge, put a, mo a monster or a gate of forgiven from your field on the bottom of your deck. When this card attacks, put up to three Dragon World or Guardian from your drop zone on the bottom of your deck in any order. If you put three cards, return all cards on your opponent's field into his or her hand. Then deal damage equal to the number of cards returned. 2 crit, 828. That is really good. The amount of control. I'm excited to see where what my last triple R is going to be. Me. Discard a card from hand, destroy a monster on your opponent's field, counter, give a monster plus 2 plus 2 and counter attack. Speed law, go away. Silhouette Damien. Pay two gauge, put a spell from your drop zone into the soul. Put a soul from this card in the drop zone, pay one gauge, destroy a card on your opponent's field. Then if you have 15 or more in drop, put the top card of your deck into this card's soul. Soul guard. Pay one gauge, search your deck for a gate of judgment. 5 to 1. Seeing you, go away card burn, eyes and tiger. Oh, this is the buddy rare. In not buddy rare form. Mm. 
Doogie. Dragon's Blessing. Filer. Schrodinger. Leg Blade Rejector. Pay one gauge. When this card attacks, you have a size 3 Neo Dragon on the field with the top card that can engage. 5 2. Seen it. Seen it. Seen it. Seen it. Pay two gauge when this card attacks. Discard a card from your hand. If your flag is Legend World, put a monster from your drop into your hand. If your flag is Star Dragon World, put a card from your drop into this card's soul. 726. Puppy Tsukikage, Divine Guidance, Sister Frill, Kira Rain, DD Dragon Envoy, Muriel. Pay one gauge when this card attacks. If you have three or less cards in your drop zone for this turn, this card gets double attack. When this card attacks and destroys your opponent's monster, gain one life. 413. Night Guardian. You should have been an adventurer too. But, you know, I guess Knights is the real dungeon attribute now. I think I saw a foil coming up. Nope. Just two rares. Is that a rare? No, that's common. Oh, wait. This one's new. Toradori. Come on, be called to the center. Shadow Dive. If there are four more cards in your opponent's drop zone, get plus three and crit plus one. So, turn two? It's a two, three, one Shadow Diver? It's a Black Dragon Death and Deep? 5 2. 5 3 1. That's retarded. I mean, not retarded. That's sorry. Bad bad wording. No. Uh, please don't hurt. Can't do that on the internet. Can't do that on the internet. Sorry, internet. 